I guess I have to do it myself. I know it's not. It's the heart-stopping moment. A Donald Trump hater rushes the stage and leaping into action, Trump's personal bodyguard. He is 57-year-old Keith Schiller, and he is never far from Trump's side. Here he is mixing it up with a protester outside Trump Tower six months ago, tearing down a sign calling Trump a racist. When the protester tries to get the banner back, Schiller punches him. Sit down. Sit down. When Trump ordered Univision anchorman Jorge Ramos out of a press conference last August, it was Sit Keith down, Schiller please. who firmly escorted the broadcaster cold. out. I'm a, no, 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 I'm a reporter and I have, I'm, don't touch me, sir. Please don't touch me, sir. You cannot touch me. Trump and Schiller go way back. Sometimes the bodyguard serves as a prop, as in this stage smackdown between Trump and wrestling honcho Vince McMahon in 2007. is a former NYPD detective who has been Trump's head of security for 16 years. Former Secret Service agent Jonathan Wackrow. Trump's personal bodyguard has been protecting him for 16 years. Uh -huh. What kind of relationship do you think they have? It's a, it's a relationship built out of trust. You know, Keith has been uh, put into a very difficult position to protect a very exposed individual with a lot of risk. Move to Europe! There was more trouble at a Trump event in North Carolina today. His town hall style rally with New Jersey Governor Chris Christie was repeatedly interrupted by protesters.